Dead Comic Club on Purpose by Dave Pilkey. Cat Kid is copyright by Dave Pilkey. And it's published by Graphics, an imprint of Scholastic Inc. Last time in the Comic Club. <laughs> These frogs went to space, and they all got new cars, and they went to go fight bullies, and there was this very angry cheerleader. So he tied him up to save a bat, and then he grabbed our cars, and then our friend told us we could transform. So I did. I am so impressed I could eat this microphone. Would you like a bite? Uh. Hold on, my comic first. The ghost girl was sad because her cat was alive now. So she moped and they were like, could you just be happy for like 30 minutes? And then they smiled at her all weird and she was like, just let me be sad, you know? But they didn't stop. And then she left until she peed herself. And then they fell asleep. Yes, very nice. Now, would you like a bite of my microphone? Uh... <coughs> oh, maybe later. What are you doing in here? Nothing, don't look! It's just comics. <laughs> of course, yeah, comics. And I need you to send them to the publisher, Lenny. Okay, thanks, bye! Uh... Why do I even try? Chapter 12, new comic, old problem. Welcome back to a new day of thrills and drama. What can you tell us about your new comic? Uh, well, it's, um, uh, we made it, um, it's like, uh, just read the comic. Okay. Chubbs makes spider bot part two the birth of big bubba baby head written and directed by the hacker bros when we last saw our heroes they were being terribly tormented by the not very nice club your daddy has training wheels on his tricycle yeah and i'll bet he's really smart too scott that's not an insult that's a compliment we're, we're the not very nice club, remember? Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. Hey Chubbs, I've had enough of those guys. Shall we fight them? Nah, let's go get sushi. Okay, smell you later. Bye bye buddies. Scott! Hmm, our mal malvolent, mal malvolent taunting didn't unnerve them. I know, and our mean insults didn't bother them either. Uh, what we need is some muscle. Come on, Scott. Let's turn this van around. I know just the guy who can help us. Shoom. Soon they arrive at the home of Big Bubba Boxer Buns. Ding dong. Ha <laughs> ha. What do you want? I invite you to join us. Together we shall defeat Chubbs McSpiderbutt. I got no beef with Chubbs. Oh, really? Well, he said your gym shorts and dress shoes look silly together. No, he didn't. Shush. Oh, he did, did he? So, Chobbs makes Spiderbot thinks he can insult my fashion sense. And get away with it. Chobbs is going down. He. Meanwhile, mmm, this sushi is good. Are you gonna eat your uni? It's all yours, little buddy. Thanks. Hey, Jake. Do you think we will ever be famous? You mean like Spider-Man? Who's that? What? You've never heard of Spider-Man? No. You need to read more, Chubbs. Spider-Man is famous. He shoots webs from his wrist and what? He shoots webs from where? From his wrists. That doesn't make sense. Spiders don't shoot webs from their wrists. They shoot, they shoot them from their butts. Dude, he can't go around shooting webs out of his butt. Spider-Man is for kids. No parent is going to buy their kid a Spider-Man t-shirt if he's shooting a bunch of if he's shooting a bunch of webs out of his butt. That's disgusting. That's fake science. That Spider-Man guy needs to n needs to n -n -n needs to What's wrong, Chubbs? Th this tuna tataki has too 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 much P -p pepper don't do it chubbs ah uh, ah uh, ah uh. chubbs please 
Think of the children. Ah, ah, ah. Don't do it, Chubbs. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, chew. Well, Chubbs, we may be famous someday, but I don't think we'll sell too many t-shirts. Meanwhile, Chubbs McSpiderbutt, come out and play, yay. Chubbs. Gee, I wonder where he could be. Warning, low-hanging sign. Clunk. Oh, hey, stop the van. You just knocked my head off. Nice driving, Scott. Don't worry, Big Bubba. I'll just back up. Reverse. Cruncha crunka. And so, thanks a lot, Scott. Ka click. You ran over my head. I can't go around looking like this. Go buy me a new head. And make sure it's a scary one. Okay, here I go. Dum dee dum dee dum. This must be the place. And so, la dee da da. What took you so long? Give me that. Uh, hey, what the heck is this? Why? I told you to buy me a scary head. I did. I'm terrified of babies. Will the not very nice club finally defeat Chubbs and Jake? Will our heroes ever appear on officially licensed t-shirts? Will Scott overcome his fear of babies? Find out in the next thrilling adventure of Chubbs Make Spider Bot. That was very good, Drake. Thanks. Me and Gilbert and Rico made it together. Hey, Melvin, you should send our book to that publisher lady. Are you kidding? That comic was very offensive. It's all about bots. Nobody is ever going to buy a book with butt jokes in it. <laughs> <laughs> Besides, that publisher lady takes forever to write back. She probably won't write back until next year. Y'all got mail, yo. Hmm? Melvin, she wrote back. Gimme, gimme, gimme! <laughs> oh, you don't just grab things. She read Puppy's comic. <laughs> well, what did she say? She rejected it. Huh? Why? She doesn't like all the ghosts and skeletons and stuff. She said it's disturbing. Oh. Hey, maybe you can change it. Like how? You know, uh, just make everyone normal. Normal? Um, no thanks. Why not? I don't want to be normal. I just want to be me. I'm sorry if that's disturbing. I quit the club. Oh. Wow, two quitters in one week. We're dropping like flies. Chapter 13. Just be you. And so, then she said my comic was disturbing, which means that I'm disturbing. That's not what it means, Poppy. It just means she didn't like your story. She didn't like mine either. But a very wise person once said, everybody doesn't have to like the same things. And I'm glad they don't. Do you want to live in a world where everybody is the same? <laughs> no way! That would be disturbing. Hmm. If I was as awesome as you, Poppy, I wouldn't change a thing. Okay, I won't. See you later. Mm. <laughs> oh, hi, Daddy. Hi, Poppy. Hi, Naomi. Hey. Are you ready to rejoin the club? I guess so. I overheard what you said to Poppy back there. Those were very wise words. Yeah, I know. You're good at comforting people. Hey, maybe you found your purpose. Maybe you're going to be a counselor someday. Do counselors make a lot of money? Well, not usually, but they- Pass! Chapter 14! A bunch of stuff that changed everything! Soon! Hey, guess what? I'm back! Are you going to change your comic? Nope. I'm just gonna be me. Hey, everyone. Look who else is back. <gasps> uh. 
What are you smiling about? Nothing. Mm. Hmm. Huh? Uh. Hey, Daddy. Can we get a dog? Uh, no, Pedro. We can't. No, not mail. Huh? Melvin. She wrote back again. No, thanks. I don't want to read it. It's about Baby Frog Squad. Oh, great. It's probably offensive to astronauts. Melvin, you need to read this. Uh, uh, huh? Huh? Uh, oh, ah! She liked it! Baby Frog Squad is going to be published! No way! <laughs> yes way! She's sending us a contract! It's gonna be a real book! Hooray! All you have to do is make 200 more pages. And... Wait, what? It has to be 224 pages. 224 pages?! We can't make 224 pages. Oh, that's way too many pages. It's, it's impossible. I'm all stressed out. I can't do it. It's too much. I need to lie down. I need to quit. Me too. Me three. Me four. Hey! Nobody is gonna quit. We're all going to work on this together. One page at a time. Everyone is going to help. And I, I am going to direct. We're not just going to make a book. We are going to make the best book ever. Hooray! Hooray! That night. <laughs> hey. You kids get back into bed. I'm <laughs> serious. Naomi, what is going on? I'm directing. Get back in oh. bed now. Go on, get in there. I love being a director, Daddy. It's the perfect job for me. I'm good at storytelling. I'm good at bossing people around. I'm smart. I'm talented. I'm an influencer. You're humble. Yeah, I'm humble. Hey, Daddy, do directors make a lot of money? Well, yes, sometimes. Sweet! Hey, everybody, we're getting an ice cream machine! Hooray! You kids get back in the bed right now! Hmm. Well, folks, we've come to the end of a dramatic day. Will everyone be able to work together? Will Naomi's craving for cash be her downfall? And will the baby frogs ever stay in bed? Find out in our next thrilling adventure, Cat Kid Comic Club. Hey, I was supposed to say that. You heard it straight from Sarah Hadoff's big mouth. Cat Kid Comic Club 4 is coming out soon. Cat Kid Comic Club Collaborations comes out November 29th, and you can pre-order it now. Just click the link in the description below, and it will take you straight to where you can get it. And if you want to get all the other Cat Kid Comic Club books, those links will be in the description too. Well, we hope you liked this series book crowd video all that stuff so hit the like and be sure to subscribe and then you'll know when the next thing comes out okay that'll do it for today love you bye